We got one out. <laughs> Maybe less than 10 minutes into the drive. Of course, always. Because. <laughs> are cozy and comfy. Yes. Well, I don't have my blanket on right now. Okay. Well, it's going to get colder where we go a little bit. Where are we That's going, Derek? I brought my beanie. We are headed about three <laughs> hours <laughs> up north <laughs> past now. Sacramento to uh, Polark Pines, just uh, beyond Placerville. Is it three hours because of the trailer or is yeah, it? Yeah. Okay. You know, unfortunately I can't drive like 80 miles an hour, so. <laughs> Normally it'd be like two. <laughs> yeah. So, but, um, Pollock Pines, it's about nine, you know, it's about a, actually it's about 120 miles away. And uh, we're going to a lake called Fredrickson Lake. It's at a campsite, a recreation area called Sly Park Recreation. Near Placerville, right? Placerville, old stomping grounds of Ames. Yes, near oh, Tahoe. Yeah. yeah. No what? snow though. No so snow that's, yet. We're not, it won't be high enough. No, uh -huh. no snow yet. It's only about 3,500 feet elevation, so, and it's, pretty dry season right now so that'll be good for one last camping trip before Yay. the end of the year. What? And guess who we're taking? We're taking our elf out. Oh she's come along for the ride so that means she's gonna see you in your good and your bad all over on our um, vacation and see how well you guys are behaving. <laughs> But I would love to help out with the driving sometimes, but he doesn't really. I think he prefers what? to drive. I love driving, but <laughs> I, I have said multiple times that I would love it if you yes, but learned and how to how to pull learn it. how to drive how to drive and pull a trailer. <laughs> oh, so we were thinking about tips um, that might help you that we did not do as a new trailer family. Trying to exit and leave At the house, <laughs> but as the routine normally goes, two and a half hours <laughs> later was when the reality, the reality was when we actually left. I think there were some things on the trailer end that might have could have been done the day before. Yeah. So first tip is here's the deal. First tip is clean your windows. Clean your, I mean, clean your mirrors before you go out on a trip. Otherwise, they're incredibly dusty and you can't see anything. So that's your first tip. Second tip, prep day before. Hooking up your hooking up your tow vehicle if you can the day before. Have it ready to go. It's, which is the whole point of the new, new members of the trailer family yes. type community. We're beginners. <laughs> this is only our second real trip. And maybe this is trip, so obvious, but like... Trip. You think you can fit it all in 
in the same day, but you can't. But you can't because you're not a pro at it yet. And yeah. so everything is going to take longer. Yes. So it's more of a two day process before leaving yes. of first day. These are the tasks. Second day, leave the simpler tasks, yep. which you we're know. going, we're, we're going to be boondocking. There's no hookups at our site. So I had to fill up the, the fresh water tank. I could have done that yesterday instead of trying to leave it for today. Firewood. Going to the store and getting wood, Not extra the day groceries the day of. Like Could have done that earlier on. For the, fires. Earlier on the week. Campfires. So, again, things yeah. that we could have done. Yeah. Earlier on in the week. Um, mainly the day before. But even didn't. just like stuff that you could throw in there, like all of the stuff for cleaning dishes, your bathroom stuff, keeping a spare, like the travel size stuff in the bathroom at all times. So that's already done. Those are some of our learn as we, yes. as we we'll go mm -hmm. tips. And if we think of more, we'll let you know, but two and a half hours was not a fun delay, no. but it happened. And now we'll be setting up in the dark yet again for our third time. Amy's favorite. <laughs> the next day. Okay, we made it to Sly Park Recreation Area in uh, Pollock Pines and got set up last night. So here's our spot. Not bad. It overlooks the lake. Got some neighbors over here. It was a tough time getting this thing leveled. Three blocks up because we're on a big slope. Luckily I had some extra chocks to be able to get up. So we're good now. But yeah, here's the road. We're right off of it. Big slant. Let's go down and see the kids. I think they're down by the lake. <laughs> Good throw, buddy. Whoa! Hi. So what we're doing it's today a job. is we're making crystals. We're trying oh, to crystal. We're finding and breaking open rocks and finding these beautiful. Ah, this one is because we these have beautiful colors. Whoa! And our, um. That's cool. Okay. <coughs> I found one. So I. I took a flattened rock and inside this Luca. blue stuff. Now, now you can oh. We had a Santa. What are you fishing for, Sienna? Um, fish. Fish. Fishing for fish. That's good. All right, let's see Ella cast. Ready, Ella? She's getting on the rock. She's reeling back. Whoa! I went up. Okay, ready? One more from the professional caster. Woo! Please don't pollute. Keep your dog on a leash. We're gonna take the Sierra Chimney Trail. It's almost like to Sienna. Hazel Creek. Yep. This is like a Spartan Trail. Please be careful. Oh my goodness. Danger. That's scary. Keep off. Hazardous area. Ella, Ella. Ella. Danger, danger. Oh, we gotta grab a picture. Remember this? The branch? Daddy, remember the branch? What is it called? That looks so oh, funny. Cool. Daddy, what is this called? What is it called? Well, I'm sorry. What is it called again? Yeah. That's Manzanita. Mm -hmm. What's Manzanita? What's in there, Chloe? Mm -hmm. Going to the log. It's a limbo. Oh gosh, man. a limbo. A lot of ah! <laughs> I, I Push ups. Find. Push ups. Pull ups. Push ups. I find. Oh yeah, Luca. You don't even need to bend over. No. Okay, ready. Limbo. Okay, that's really low. <laughs> On your marks. Get set. Go. Woo! Woo! Oh! Oh! 
Slide Park Recreation Area Birds of Special Status. Bald Eagle. You can spot a bald eagle here. An osprey. Northern Gosh. So you see, go go Goshawk? I don't know how to pronounce that. Ooh, a California spotted <laughs> owl. And all the fish you can catch. Bass, the crappies, the catfish? trout, bluegill, brown trout. Nope, no catfish here. Huh? Walking through the forest, walking through the forest. Next day. <laughs> I've never been to Apple Hill though. Alright, new place, Apple Hill. Let's Apple. check it out. Parked along the side of the road here. And there's about 500 people here. And uh, we'll go get some donuts and treats and yummy fun apple stuff at Boa Vista Farms. So, we'll check this out. Here we are. Boa Vista Farms. This place look fun, Luca? Yeah. Yeah? Yep. Oh look, you guys can take a picture. You wanna put your face in an apple? Busy, busy, busy. Oh my apple. Yeah, what do you guys think, huh? Look all the stuff we got. Look at these huge pears. Freshly picked. I might have to get some produce and bring it back home. This is not Apple Hill. Got some Apple stuff. Yeah, this is not Apple Hill. Then what is Apple Hill? Well, this is Boa Vista. There's an Apple Hill. Right it's all Apple Hill. I make a stocking when I get home. Yeah, look, we got some fresh honey. Wait, fresh money. Honey. Oh. <laughs> fresh money. Yeah, they're just selling, handing out money. <laughs> I'll take apple everything, please. Oh, yeah. I love your, that's a good Your apple, when you cut up apple, you put all the treats on top. And like way too much. Apple strudel. Oh, man, Ooh, these are apple brownies, sir. This yeah. is a pair of the apple brownies. Interesting. So I wonder if it's chocolatey then? And then these yeah, it's chocolate. I can see are the apple chocolate. strudels, but they also look like a brownie. I don't want to do it. Yeah. Hold on. Let's go get her what? Oh, my eyes are going. Daddy's going to get a knife for the oh. apple. But Yay! You know I got a curl apple. Let's see it. Okay, oh, let's see this. Can you open the box for me? Yeah, I'll open it. Okay. Here we go. We got a frozen apple pie. No, look at But it's a duck caramel with all the crumbling. Hold on, I know how to. No, we got no, apple cider. Classic apple. Nice on Mom, keep it Where in there. Honey. We got... Mom, it's gonna blow away. Look, it's stuck. Oh, it's okay. Please don't. Just grab it. It's soft. Let's see. It's not... Apple, maple, bacon, jam. That's a gift. Maple got better for us. Stir apple butter. That's a gift. Oh, yeah, you can try those. Apricot. Caramel. And Derek picked out the dill pickle hot sauce. Oh, yeah, yeah!
Ooh, general blacksmithing and horseshoeing. Let's all keep an eye on it. Look at that, that's cool. This is where they kept horses. The service station in the country. They provided hay grain stables for the animals and bicycle. Vehicle. Vehicle repair. They also kept horses, mules, carriages, and wagons to rent, trade, or sell. All right. I'm holding the You can hold the fifth. We got a blacksmith shop. Look, they got the horseshoes in here. Look at this little house. We got a Christmas tree. It's where the. Cool. Look at all these horseshoes. This is what the blacksmith makes. A horseshoe? Did someone actually look at it? No, this is a historical site. This is what it used to kind of look like. Yeah. Post office. Look at this place. Gun Beckart's gun shop. Jules Francois Beckart was a gunsmith who came here in 1849 to sell guns and mine gold. He soon became a close friend of James Marshall. Exciting. Look at the bars. Yeah, I like the bars. The principal bars. Oh. Hello? Can't see in there. Do, do, do. Whoa. Cool. The diggins. Oh, look at their mining in here. They were digging for gold under the ground. See any gold in there, buddy? No. Okay. It was took in all. This is where the gold miners lived. They lived in little cabins like this. There's their little table, their bed. Where's their bed? Right, back there. The earlier structures were canvas tents made from recycled sailcloth taken yeah. from abandoned ships in the San Francisco Bay. Isn't that cool? Let's check out little houses that they lived in. Let's look up here. Yeah. Look at this. Look at this stuff. Mhm. Mm they use. Oh, it's like a little. It's a little car. Look it. A little car. Yep. They, this is how they pulled rocks and rocks and special. They had gems and stuff in them and gold through the caves. Can't climb on it. Don't climb on it. Cool stuff. What is this? What is this? Hey, uh -huh. Careful. It's a fence. Sapling stamp mill. Miners easily made a primitive Ooh, one stamp mill from a young that. tree. The With the help of the sapling that. spring, they raised no, a crusher no. and pounded gold ore in an iron kettle or stone mortar. The crushed rock was then panned to remove the gold. Gold. Yep, it's the California stamp mill. Mormon workers cabin. In 1846, President James K. Polk authorized the army to enlist Mormons to fight in the Mexican War. Like 496 men joined the Mormon battalion in Council Bluffs, Iowa on July 16, 1846. Hey, they marched wonderful. over 2,000 miles. This looks like our rug, except we have a blue one. Oh yeah, look at that. That's cool. Really dark. Yeah. No, we're not oh, it does look like a ride, right? huh? So these are their old wagons. These are probably mule pulled wagons. Pulled them it's with their mules. The Pacific rut ran on the railroad. Oh look, here's all their little supplies. That's a pretty one. I like that one. They got some chickens. Mm. Oh, a little doll. Look at these little dolls that they made for the kids. And you know, a book. You know. Well, that might be a diary. Fortune in sight. Chance discovery leads to change. Took one small nugget to change the whole country, and then the world rushed in. The Coloma Road. Here in the valley, the Coloma Indians, James W. Marshall, discovered gold on January 24, 1848. Very cool. This is where the gold rush started. The gold rush started here. Look at them panning for gold. Well, don't do that. <laughs>
Wait, can I swim? <laughs> you want to swim in there, buddy? Yeah. You can go rafting on it. Mm. What do you think of that? Mommy and I have done it before. What? Rafting along the American River. This is called the American River. Yeah. <laughs>